Hello, I'm Tiffany Barsotti of Heal and Thrive. And I'm going to give you a little information about the four archetypes of survival. These archetypes are the victim, the saboteur, the prostitute, and the inner child. Now, all of these we all have. Many people want to negotiate and not have them, but it's a truth that we all have them. And this is something that was proposed by, and I see it live out, through Carolyn Mace's work. Now, the idea of archetypes didn't originate with her. There were Carl Jung and many other teachers who taught about the archetypes, which is really the symbolism of the subconscious mind. So the opportunity to know and interrelate with these archetypes is very important also on the journey for knowing thyself, but also in how we negotiate our choices and manage our energy every day. The inner child is one where you will choose through a list of various types of inner child. So there's a wounded child, there's an orphan child, there's the magical child, the divine child, the nature child. There are many to choose from. And if it's appropriate that none of them fit, you actually create your own. So there's a, a style, a manner in which we get to introduce ourselves to this innate archetype. That is the inner child, one that you actually get to choose from. The other ones, you don't. The saboteur, the victim, and the prostitute. So briefly, the saboteur is how things, how you, how things show up in your life and how you sabotage. So where it is that you have made choices to do certain things and maybe not take actions that have been beneficial. The victim is how we victimize ourselves how we keep ourselves in a pattern of whether it's playing small or from the things that we eat or the choices that we continue to make. This is in one way how, or in several ways, how we actually can victimize ourselves. The other one is the prostitute. So it's a little more, it, it, it sounds kind of daunting, but if you think about the prostitute from the angle of how it is that we negotiate away our power, having to do with what is it that we need from somebody that we are willing to give our, a, a piece of ourselves for? And these are good questions to be able to understand because all of these archetypes have a light and a shadow side. The objective is to know both sides, not just the light and not just the shadow. And by getting to know them, they're helpful. These are also sometimes called the inner critic committee, and they get a lot of their information from our early childhood. So if you're interested in learning more about these archetypes and how they fit in with personal self-integration or just these archetypes in general, I'm happy to share with you. Please book a 15-minute free consult at your convenience, and I will look forward to speaking with you about them. Thank you.